Mantis looking like he's gonna attack here. Oh, oh my god. Mantis, chill out on him. Chill out on him. Oh my god. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna be looking at Kush the Mantis Shrimp, some of his greatest fights, and I'm also gonna include some cool Mantis fights that I've found on the internet, but I think you guys are really gonna enjoy this episode, so if you guys like this, give it a thumbs up, and uh, let me know down below so I can make more content like this. It's the moment we've all been waiting for, Mantis Shrimp versus Crayfish. Let's go. All right, guys, so the mantis is right there. Oh, oh, and I have to put him right in. Oh, guys. Oh, oh, record with no flash. Record with no flash, bro. Turn your flash on. Oh my God. Oh my God, guys, he's on his back. He's on his back. I think the crayfish is gonna go for it, bro. Yeah. You wanna get him to he's gonna go for a pinch. Sure, man. The shrimp the shrimp just needs to turn his head. Oh, he yeah. sees him, bro. He sees him. Oh, no. Does it? What? Oh, yeah. oh, oh, he's piecing him up. He's piecing him up. Okay, so the Mantis definitely won that fight, but now we're gonna look at an even more aggressive Mantis, and he's gonna be fighting this crab. It's a good looking crab, honestly. I would eat that crab. Oh, and I think the Mantis is thinking the same thing. Oh, guys, the way he punched him right there was hilarious. Watch when we rewind that. That is so funny, the way he just jumped out and punched him. He just charges up and then rams the shit out of him. Okay, the Mantis is just plotting now. They do this a lot while they're attacking. They know that their prey is in defense mode and he's not going to attack them. So they take a little time to plot out the perfect attack. And this one actually goes into his cave before attacking. Holy crap, this is one aggressive mantis. Okay, so after a brutal pounding by the mantis, this crab gets away for a second, but not for long. Oh, damn. And he took the mantis's house. Now, I don't think that's a good idea. If someone is beating you like that, guys, never go in and take the man's house. I'm not trying to victim blame the crab or anything, but that is just not a good decision. And now he's walking back through that cave. Those two caves connect. And there you go, guys. He's getting beat. Hold on a sec. Upside down? This guy clobbered him while he was running away. Oh my god, guys, you don't even know how many hate comments I get saying, how do you enjoy this? Guys, this is freaking bread and butter to me. This is one of the coolest animals on the face of this planet. I, I just gotta say it, hands down. And the mantis is just gonna keep spotting him and then beating him down. If you didn't know, mantis have some of the best eyes in the entire animal kingdom, so it's not hard for this mantis to clearly spot where this guy is, run over, and beat the crab's ass. This crab is somehow walking away. You would be surprised some crustaceans are really tough and resilient. And it looks like he's making a break for it, trying to get to this cave. Let's see, guys. Will he make it? Nope. Somehow the crab is still alive, and when it comes to death matches, these can take a while. Mantis heading to his house for a quick moment before he gets back into the action. And 
now that the crab is all tired out, the mantis is going to try to kidnap him here, right here. And oh my god, guy, guy, get away. No, and that's when he starts punching you once he realizes he can't just kidnap you. And I don't know how well the judges are going to score this round for the crab. He looks pretty beat up here. No, seriously, guys, this crab is not well. I think the mantis is going to go ahead and pull his victim down into his lair. If you guys look, this is a pretty awesome mantis shrimp home, and that was a great fight. You can tell when you give them a natural home, they really want to fight. They really want to eat live prey. And this is not something you have to force your mantis shrimp to do. They will do it all on their own. I think they draw a lot of pleasure out of fighting live things, actually. As funny as it is to say, this animal has evolved over millions of years to want to do exactly this. So if you guys have a mantis shrimp, feed him some live food. Send me the video and maybe I'll react to it. I've got one last clip for y'all. This is my mantis shrimp kush. He's my main mantis shrimp. But in my smaller fluval flex, I have a super red mantis shrimp. He's very beautiful, but this guy gets out of pocket sometimes and look, look, just look what he did. My mantis shrimp went on a literal murderous rampage and he killed my horseshoe crab. Now you guys are going to probably say that I'm stupid for putting a horseshoe crab in here. But the truth is, is that he was in here for months when the mantis wasn't even in here. He was living under the sand peacefully. And one day he came out and this fool just starts beating his ass and I felt so bad. So RIP to the horseshoe crab, man. I I'm sorry. This fool is running around with the horseshoe crab. Bro. Bro, you're messed up. You're insane. You're literally insane. What are you doing with it? Just let him live, let him chill. Unfortunately, no chilling was done. Mr. Shu was eaten in cold blood. This fucker. And my mantis went on to live another day as king of his damn tank. Yes, guys, I love my mantis shrimp so much. And if you guys like these videos too, drop a like for me. I I'm just came back to YouTube. A lot of these guys are, you know, trying to jump in my niche and stuff like that. And I'm trying to bring you guys the best mantis content possible. So, hope you guys like this video. Made it just for y'all. And peace. Actually, I got one last message, guys. I'm in my fish room right now. I just set this thing up, guys. It is pretty big. I'll put some videos over here. But this thing is sick, guys. This new fish room is sick, guys. And I'm going to be putting a bunch of tanks here on the other levels. You see we got four different levels on this thing. So stay tuned. I'm going to be having some pretty cool videos coming your way. And I'm, uh, I'm doing this YouTube thing now.